and it's four o'clock we are really in here we are really out here streaming today hello welcome to the channel hi hi everybody i'm trixie i have the chat here oh, look at that you guys we're just what we're not going to do today is dog on my green screen abilities look when i put my arms up the green screen shows up in the background we're not going to talk about it i'm at the trixie motel do i look like i'm just a girl at the pool Let's be honest, I have been in Dragon Palm Springs plenty of times. I don't recommend it. <laughs> However, we do have great events at the Trixie Motel. But just if you're ever at the Trixie Motel or in Palm Springs in general and the drag queens are performing, dig deep in your pockets because it is about 120 degrees there sometimes and people have wigs on. So anyway, welcome, everybody. Thank you for coming. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, I think we should just get into it. It's going to be a fabulous day. The chat is wild here today. We are here officially with The Sims. We're celebrating The Sims' 24th birthday. Clap, clap, clap. Very exciting. And um, I'm 34, which means The Sims came out when I was 10. And not to age myself, but I remember The Sims coming out. Some of you, I don't want to swear. We can swear. The Sims said I can swear. So some of you bitches might not remember when The Sims came out, but some of us, some of us, experienced The Sims 1 in real time, and it was a very magical time. Um, so I just had, this is my little confessional. This is where I'm going to come, to be honest with you guys. Um, be vulnerable here in my interview chair at RuPaul's Drag Race. I looked up The Sims yesterday. I was doing some, like, deep dives because I'm like, I was like, God, 20, like, four years of The Sims. Some of you in the chat are probably not as old as The Sims. And I'm like, I'm thinking of Sims Free Play. Sims Online, Sims Mobile, like Sims Medieval, Sims like uh, Hot, like I'm thinking of all the expansions over the years and I was like, they must have some kind of records. So I looked it up on Wikipedia. The success of The Sims has resulted in Guinness World Records, including numerous world records, like the most expansion packs for a video game series, the best-selling PC game series with sales ranging from, Sims, I don't want to like dig deep in your pockets, but sales ranging from 36 to 50 million units. Wow. It seeks, it's the 10th, it, it ranks 10th among the best selling video game franchises of all time with a sales figure of over 200 million combining the whole series. That's pretty fierce. It's really fierce. I mean, we're going to get into it, but you have to think too. I'm a member of the community and people have like, you know, People have, like, you know, entire, like, bisexual or gay relationships in The Sims way before it was talked about or allowed or cool. And that's pretty fierce. I did read on Wikipedia, though, that apparently The Sims had an, a canceled um, film, which is kind of a bummer. But. Are we lagging, seriously? You're lagging, huh? Come on, lag. I think I'm creasing on my lid, too. Can I have a little eyeliner? We do have a makeup help in the studio today. Ooh, reaching in. Ooh. There it is. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You guys, I'm gonna go on break for one second and look at this lag and I'm gonna be right, right back. And we're diagnosing here. I took everything else in the house off the Wi-Fi. I'm hard, hardwired in, you guys. This is just a shout out to the streamers who provide content to you all the time. When I was streaming like twice a week, I was like, it stayed hard. It, it never really got easy. I mean, these streamers out here talking for hours, interacting with fans for hours, trying to play games well and watch a chat and pet their dog. And like, it's it's too, it's it's a lot of things in the air. But um, let's just get going here. My character is chilling. This is the Trixie. She oh, she doesn't look great from that angle, but let's see. She doesn't look great at this angle. Um. My dream, one of my dreams, is to start a drag pack in The Sims and make some much, much bigger hairs because this hair looks pretty good. 
The Sims actually, I <laughs> Sims 4, I think, has really good hairstyles. The, and every time there's a pack, there's like more, better, cooler, newer ones. But um, uh -huh. you guys, if you watched my video from yesterday, you might know that I'm having dust bunny issues. I don't know how to get rid of these girls. I Instead of <laughs> stepping on them, I have evolved into just accepting that they are here and that they're, they're part of the lifestyle. Um, Can Kubu Koiba? Oh, yes. Yeah, go find me some valuables. No beam. Sure. Oh, the dust uh Trixie's dust friend did not feel particularly motivated or happy, but did manage to half heartedly rustle up a few simoleons. Six dollars has been added to the household. Perhaps a little bribery Aha. in the form of dust snacks might encourage her dusty ah. friend to feed it? I guess. You know, I don't have a pet for a reason, and I certainly don't have a pet because I want to feed dust animals. Freeze. No beam. Easy to make friends in The Sims because there's always somebody biking outside your house. There's always somebody walking by my house and just standing there and talking to themselves. And so if I ever like need social interaction, I'm like, I guess I'll just go outside and, you know. Start talking to that random person. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You guys, is it too early for a Vent. pee break? Hold, please. Uh -huh. Hold. And we're back. So, hey. Um, one of the challenges The Sims has me doing today is there are, um, what would you call it? Like scavenger hunts, basically. <sighs> There's some scavenging going on, and I'm going to share with you what these are. It's going to be quite a little bit of a, a struggle. I'm going to be honest. The Sims was like, these are the scavenger hunt items. They're not easy. I thought it was going to be like, oh, make make a grilled cheese or like uh, get be, have an, be energized after taking a bath. I'm like, um, befriend, befriend. What is my character? <laughs> Did you see me doing sit-ups? One of them was like, befriend death, the Grim Reaper. So that means somebody has to die. And I live alone. And I'm not willing to die to become friends with the, the Grim Reaper. You know what I mean? So I don't know. We'll just have to see what happens here. We're just going to have to find out on our own. Girl, just go. Oh, my God. Baby Venus says just go kill someone. Now, The Sims gives you a lot of flexibility. I wouldn't say that going out and killing someone is recommended even in The Sims universe. I could do what I've done in the past, which is invite someone over. And by the way, if you play The Sims, I know it takes a second. Memorize the like hot cues, memorize like all the shortcuts. It makes playing The Sims so much more fun. Let's go meet her. Let's go say hi. Let's be rude. Let's just let's just do it the right way. Let's just be rude. Hi, rude. Trixie, name the dust bunny. Girl, I can't even get the dust bunny to accept my love here. I mean the dust bunny is acting like Become friends with dag, dag. Move. Okay, Zimone. what's the faster way to do this? All right, um, I have some options here. Um, the Sims 24 while 24 checklist challenge. The options are woohoo with Don Lothario, who I don't even know in this game. So that's, that's a little bit far off. Befriend the Grim Reaper. That feels possible. Eat the cow plant's cake. I don't have a cow plant. And I'm not like a Sims cheater. So there are cheats, but I don't cheat much, you know. Oh, yeah. I have that one, too. Yeah. But I have a longer checklist I'm going to show you guys here. So, yeah. Woohoo with Don Lothario. I don't, girl, I'm not even friends with him. And if you guys know me, I, you know, I'm not into... We're going to have to get to know each other. I will say, as forward as The Sims is with uh, intimacy and, like, different types of relationships... I have always find it kind of touching that in The Sims you have to like be in love with someone to woohoo with them. It's sweet. All right. Show us your stories with The Sims Checklist Challenge. You guys, I'm going to tweet this out right now. I'm going to tweet it this out so you guys can kind of hold me accountable here. Shower in the rain. Break into a Sims home. Woohoo with Vladislaus Stroud. Okay. I'm friends with him. So I think let's start there. Let's get in touch with him and see if he wants to come over. Let's call him up. Hello. Would someone like to call me? You could change the color of your phone. What? Why have I never done this? There's phone cases. You guys, I've been playing this game for years and I still find new information all the time. Uh, 
Let's call. Plan a stay. I'm going to plan a stay over with him. This is how I'm going to become his friend. Wait, I have met him. Hello? This is a lie. I've met him several times. We were just filming a video the other day where I had, in fact, met him. I guess we're gonna have to we're gonna have to re meet him. Ooh, sleepover. Jojo says now I need to play The Sims. Well, you can. I'm gonna tell you guys something that is pretty fierce. So, The Sims base game is available for free. You can put it on your PC. You can put it on your Mac. I have The Sims 4 just base game on my MacBook Pro, and that way when I'm traveling, I'll play like you know, cause I stream and play on my PC, but I don't exactly feel like always traveling with the tower and everything. So you guys, the lip or the um, the game is available for free for download the base game. So if you've fallen off The Sims for 24 years, let's say, this is a great opportunity to get in at the ground level. And the base game for The Sims is really fab. Now, certain expansions definitely make the game more fabulous. But the base game being free, get into it. I believe back in the day when I bought it, it was at least 40. So enjoy free. Hi, free. The production of this stream. Thank you so much. Isn't it incredible? Me out of drag. You know what happened, you guys? I sat down and I sat down and we were like getting ready. And last yesterday I set the whole stream up out of drag. And then I sat down with this wig on and I was like, the camera was cutting my wig like completely off. So I had to make myself really tiny. Do I look really tiny? Let me know in the chat if I look tiny. Production is very slay. Thank you. Hi, Free. Yeah, exactly. So skinny. Thank you. Wow. The, 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 the transitions are fire. You guys, thank you. Look at these incredible transitions. Again, it took 100% of my brain power to figure out how to do this. Shout out to all the drag queens on Twitch. I mean, uh, you know, Granny, Deer, all of them. Like, streaming is one thing. Streaming with a wig on and lashes is a whole nother thing. Not that Granny wears lashes. Maybe she does. I don't know. I don't think she does. I don't know her. Yes, truly, this is spicy stuff, Trixie. Thank you. The headphones are not what I expected. You know, I was at Best Buy yesterday, and I saw pink headphones, and I was like, am I really going to buy a pair of pink headphones for the stream? And I was like, I like these headphones I have. So I just put out this little leopard print outfit. All right. I apparently don't know that vampire, so let's move on. Because apparently that's just not possible for me. So I think that's just fine. Let's see. I'm just going to show you guys this list if that's okay. I'm showing the list. I'm showing the list. All right. All right, let me, let me make this smaller for you. Do you mind? This is a little too crazy right now. So this is what I have here. This is the list we're looking at. Lift the curse of the night wraith. I don't even know what that is. Take a chance with puffer fish. No, anything like eat something. I can't, my Sims usually can't even eat like the fruit cake. Like honestly, I don't wanna put the Sims on blast. Has anybody ever had a Sim who actually likes fruit cake? Every time I move into a new neighborhood and the neighbor shows up with fruitcake, my sim, like, gets mortally ill. Like, that that just never works for me. Is Vladdy Daddy on your relationship panel? That could be. Befriend the talking toilet. Raise a sim from the dead. That's possible. Take a selfie at the Forgotten Grotto. We could do that. We could do that. All right, let's start small. Let's go to the Forgotten Grotto and take a selfie. I think we can definitely do that. So let's just get into that. Hi, Trixie. If you guys don't know, by the way, I just, I feel like I haven't even started playing yet. Yesterday we put out a video where my character quit her career as an influencer and became a doctor. And let's just say it went about as well as we thought it would. So let's, um, let's and Arva. Huh. Him. I love to travel. <laughs> travel. Who am I taking with me? You know, Judith is really famous, but I delusionally think that she's friends with me now. So let's let's see if she'll go with me somewhere. And by the way, you guys know how I feel about the Sims music. 
I love it. I think Sims has some of the best. I talked about this in the video I took I, yesterday, but I literally ran the marathon and listened to The Sims for about half of it, like two hours of Sims 4. The Sims 4 soundtrack, I have it on Apple Music, turned, absolutely turned. So these are, if you're new to The Sims, these are all the different worlds you can live in. Um, like a lot of these come with the base game, like, you know, Oasis Springs is where I live, um, Newcrest, but most of these are, uh, you know, wait, forgot, Forgotten Grotto, where is Forgotten Grotto? I thought I was going to Forgotten Hollow. Don't make me Google, where is Forgotten Grotto? Do you guys hear me typing? The second entry, okay. Is Forgotten Grotto? There are two hidden areas. The Forgotten Grotto is in Oasis Springs. What? It is? No, it isn't. No, it isn't. Does anybody know where that is? It's a secret entrance in Oasis Springs, I believe. Sherry, I think you're right, but where is it? How do I not know about this? You guys, I've dumped a lot of hours into this game over my life, and I still feel a little stumped sometimes finding out stuff that I did not know. Where's Forgotten Grotto? Kids in the chat, let me know. It's a secret entrance in Oasis Springs. You need to be level 10 handiness? Oh, girl. We're not doing all that. I'm never... Are they kidding me? You guys, are any of these doable? I mean, I'm just... I don't want to say I'm a quitter, but like, this is a lot, Robin. Like, transform into an occult sim. That feels reasonable. I think all I have to do is get turned into a vampire or talk to a witch. Let's just go talk to some witches. I think that's the way we're going to get through this. Let's go talk to some witches first. Or maybe I should go talk to some vampires, and that could get me foot in the door to woohoo and with Vlad. Let's do that. I'm traveling again. I'd love to treble. I'd love to treble at. Come on. No, you know what? I'm going solo. I have stuff to do. And I do feel like in The Sims, a lot of times, it's a lot like real life where friends become a little bit of a liability. The level of gay on this stream is elite. I would agree. I would agree. By the way, we do have the night bot on, so don't get fierce with your language. All right, this is a family environment. Thank you. Where is she? What does she know? She's calling a car. I will say, Sims, you know it's time for vehicles. You know. You know it's time to majorly have vehicles in this game. Um. All right, let's go over to where the vampires live. The vampires live in Forgotten Hollow. What am I going to do? Go knock on Vlad's door? I mean, I guess let's just do that. Right? That's kind of an aggressive way to make friends, but whatever. I will sell this house today. I will sell this house today. Oh! No need. He's just standing here like a creep. Are you all seeing this? He's just here. He's just like, hi. Okay. I, okay. I have met him. Where did he go? It's so dark here, you guys. Yeah, let's go talk to him. She's starting to look tired. You guys, I'm not a cheater, but... My character's gonna fall asleep soon. Hi. <laughs> You didn't like my funny introduction? Great. We're a long way from woohooing people. Let's make a vampire pun. I feel like with vampires, it's scary because once you start to become friends with them, they'll also just start biting you left and right. Farobi physique, fuzzoob. I'm kind of giving up on Social Bunny because my character used to be an influencer and now I don't really care. But I think I am a vegetarian, so let's talk. I guess let's evangelize about vegetarianism to a vampire, and maybe that will huh. be a Chris good situation. Chris Baba? Mind G? Floyd? Oh, a nervous Boshnob. 
Hello? Blivar. Oh. Oh, Nabaquink. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Apparently, he's down with vegetarianism. So let's give him a heartfelt hard compliment. Him. Oh, I guess the nature of this stream now is cool. that, uh, you know, we're trying to accomplish one of these things, hopefully, and I think we're just going to start with woohooing him and see if he'll turn us into a vampire and we can get at least a couple of these ah. done. Girl, get off the phone. Ah. You're with a person. Don't be rude. Brett's in a sminchy. Farlene, you're in. Look, flirt, can I flirt? A pickup line? Here I am. Wait, did, I have to tell you guys this. This is crazy. I'm going to pause this. I have to tell you guys this. When I was playing, I was playing as Vlad for a while, and it was right when Laundry Day pack came out. So basically, when Laundry Day came out, The Sims followers voted on which pack they would like to see in the game next. I don't know if anybody in the chat remembers that. Um, oh, my God. Somebody says, if you get pregnant, hope no one imprints on your infant. That is some Twilight comedy, people. But basically, uh, I was playing as him in this big, beautiful house, and I was trying to, you know, vampires had just came come out, and I was trying to, like, you know, and then vampires had come out, and then laundry day had come out, and I'm like, a vampire doing my laundry, ha, 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 laughter and fun. I forgot to clean the limp trap, the limp trap, and Vlad went to do the laundry and got started on fire and died, and the game ended because no one else lived in the house. You know, I'm playing as a vampire because I don't want to die, so it was a little bit of a Winnie? surprise. Can we flirt, please? <laughs> Flirtation. Ask about some romantic interests. You guys, I'm trying to make the, I'm trying to fall in love. I'm trying to find love in a hopeless place. Oh my God. You'll need to get a coffin for sleeping. Yeah, that doesn't bother me. I mean, this game, it's not hard to be a vampire in this game. Huh? Ah. buff. Doi. Would you like to be my friend? Uh, with the loy. What am I embarrassed about? Uh, Awkward encounter. Uh, yeah, duh. Let's try again. Uh, Flirtation. Uh, Let's just flirt. Let's uh, just try. Rangoya. Neeb. Trips Kawafalobi? What? Galoof! Bah. Okay, this is going so well. Um, he doesn't want to speak to me. Uh, he doesn't even invite me into his house, which is kind of rude. Uh, let's break in. I mean, <laughs> like how I pivoted. Like, if you won't fall in love with me, turn me into a vampire, and woohoo me, I'm going to break into your house. I've played Vlad's lot. I know he has nice stuff. So, I'm coming in. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Where's Vlad's house? Where is his house? Hello? Is this the, is this him? This is it. Can we break in? Hello? Is it? That's not, that's not breaking in. Where is Vlad's house? You guys, am I blind? They do have giant lashes on. I think this, I think this big one is his house. Visit residence, no one's home. All right, we're breaking in. No, I'm not visiting. I'm breaking in. Oh, I guess that counts as that on your own. We're breaking in. Again, we're trying to get some of these done. I just, you know, would love to get a few of these done today, but we'll see what's possible. Okay. This is not the house. You know what? We'll break into this one anyway. I know. Let's pause. I know these Sims. This is there's a vampire like brother and sister I believe who live here, so let's just break in and see if they have any food. <laughs> Listen, The Sims is a great way to live things out that you wouldn't necessarily do in real life. I've never broken into someone's home, but we're gonna find out what that's like. All right, come on, girl, break into the house. Oh my god. Oh. Okay. Wait. Pause, pause, pause. I thought this was going to be like, I thought it was going to be like a key or a lock pick. She's just knocking the house down. How have I never done this? 
Let's break in and see if they have food, just like the good old days. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Somebody... <laughs> Staji says real covert. Yeah, not exactly. It says no one's home. Did it work? Oh. Trixie has access to the house and all of its juicy secrets. Hurry and find some dirt. All right, my character is hungry. So, like, first things first, do these vampires have a fridge? They do. Let's have a quick meal. These vampires are going to come home and I'm just going to be like, oh yeah, I've been in here eating. Hi. <laughs> She's so smooth and discreet. Thank you. As your gorgeous makeup. Thank you guys. You know, I'm just, we don't have to watch me eat. I will go into confessional mode and show you guys my makeup is beautiful today. It is gorgeous. Yes, I have hotline on. Um, this lip color is Crush from Anastasia Beverly Hills. It's so pretty. It's like mauve purpley, lippy color, but just like evens my lips out. Love it. And then I wore Krylon paint stick today, which I haven't worn in a while. I forgot how much it really like highlights your face. I don't have much highlight powder on. I did a really liberal application of cream highlighter and cream contour today. So mm. I guess this is me being wild. I break in to eat food. Well, the truth is, we have completed breaking into a Sims home, so check. That's pretty fierce. Um, drown an enemy Sim. Start a fire. Okay, this is another one that might actually be possible because I don't think my Sim has much of a cooking skill. Let's see. If you guys are new to the Sims, uh, it's pretty easy to start a fire. Uh, you know, my, my my Sim's also a kleptomaniac, so she tends to just steal things. Um, I'm very uncomfortable. It says from tainted meat. Oh, good. Oh, I'm a vegetarian and I ate meat. Oops. Yeah. No, bitch. Where are you going? Where are you going? <laughs> my God, Nick just passed me a note that says. Go for Woohoo Don Lothario, then kill him, LOL. Then to raise him from the dead or befriend the Grim Reaper. That is a good strategy. Maybe we go next door and we just see about like, you know. I got some food. Maybe I can have an energy drink quick. I don't I don't wanna sleep. Well, this isn't my house, but I'm pretty sure I could go upstairs and take a nap, so maybe we should just do that. Bold move, Cotton, to just, you know, sleep in a vampire's house but whatever. Do you have the Extreme Violence mod? I do not. I used to play with the Slice of Life mod. Um, right now, the only mod I really have is the Trixie Makeup, because I like mods, but in general, I'm not, I, I don't love having to like, you know, update the game constantly. Oh, Trixie's hospital ship is starting now. I guess we'll send her alone. I'm gonna skip work. Should I quit? Trixie, we'd love to have you join Paragons. What do you think? No. I don't I don't care for clubs in the game. The only club I'll join is when I play as a kid, I'll join like the scouting club. Because that, you get the badges, and it when you become a young adult or an adult, you have like skills built up that do translate. So it's like if you spend your toddler years doing like logic puzzles and blocks, and then you become like a girl or boy scout, then when you're an adult, you start adulthood with actual skills, which is pretty nice. I think I'm skipping work. I'm just gonna skip work. I'm gonna skip work. I'm gonna call. I'm gonna skip work. Maybe I'll quit too. You guys, if I'm, if now I'm just reduced to stealing from people's houses, I don't know why I have a job. My mic. That's weird. Is it okay now? Hello. Oh, the phone might be close to my mic. Maybe that's what it was. You can work as a robber. That's T. The doctor era is over. My horrible. Fina's stepping in. Fina's stepping in. You guys, look. Fina's here. Look. She's here, people. She's in the building. She's in the building. She's here. As mysteriously as she came, she left. 
Well, my character's getting some sleep in. I'm fully going to get fired from being a doctor, but I didn't really want to be a doctor. I just wanted to try it for a video. Um, there's actually some new careers I would prefer to try, to be honest, because whenever there's a new pack, like, I want to try the, like, forensic scientist one, the, like, cr criminologist kind of one. I haven't done that one, but I know that's one of the ones that you, like, you know, you get to go and go to work. I think that would be fun. Let's go to the bathroom. It's hard enough to keep a sim alive. Like, for me to accomplish all these little tasks, are you kidding me? They're home. Oh, my God, they are home. What do you guys think is going to happen? I think they're going to do that Sims thing where they come up and scream at me and start slapping me in the face. I've never been caught breaking into a house in The Sims, so I don't really know what happens. There's a Ghost Hunter career. That must be new. I have all the packs, but to be honest, um, my PC lives at my drag studio, and I haven't been as, like, up on it. Ugh, you guys should have seen me during COVID. That was, that was me at my best playing The Sims. Should I go introduce myself to them? Hi. Well, Vlad hates me, so... I guess I'll go meet Lilith. It's bold to just go introduce yourself to someone whose home you've broken into, but... I'm a bold person. Do you like building homes? You know, Elaine, I'm not a great builder. David Silver's a pretty good builder. I'm not... Are they going to be mad at me? Okay, well, that vampire just ran out of here. I gotta become friends. I bet... I bet I can get close to her. And maybe she'll turn me into a vampire. That's maybe the fastest way to become an occult sim here, honestly. Hi. Would you like to do flirting? You know, I need to be friends first. I can't go straight to flirting. That's why everything goes... Up. Why do I have no friends? Why does no one want to be with me? I'm just gonna vent to her. Oh my God! Lure them outside. Well, isn't it the daytime right now? They will lose energy if they go outside. Ah, one new. Maz. Yes, lesbian vampires. It could happen. But she doesn't like me. Are you guys seeing this? She doesn't want to talk to me. I mean, let's. Oh, she doesn't oh, want to talk to me. Ask if single. That's subtle, right? Ruhana de Lopa. Are you Trixie's learned that Lilith is single. Now, as we all know, in The Sims, you can fully woohoo people who are not single. I have seen it happen, so let's keep the flirting going. The flirtation. I know we're supposed to achieve all these um, things on the checklist, but if a little bit of a, les a lesbian, you know, vampire romance happens, things happen. Ask See about romantic interests. Date both of them. Oh. Honestly. Oh, girl, I'm more than late for work. I'm yeah, skipping work. I should... <laughs> Let's just, I don't know if I want to quit my job, so let's just call in to work. Can you still call in when you haven't been there for, like, a long time? Call in fake sick to work. You know, I have never in real life fake sick to work. By the way, Lilith says she likes exercise. I guess she runs at night. Did it work? Sorry to hear that. Feel better soon. Yes. Lying is the key. And where are you going? Oh. Oh. To put away a book? We're trying to have a lesbian romance here, so I gotta I gotta become best friends with her. This could take hours. She really is just she's a liar and a thief. I know she she's not into me, you guys. Oh, Real life, what we do in the shadows. Oh my God, T. Ah, yes, I'm a Clue uh, fan. This uh, house kind of gives Clue, doesn't it? Uh, uh, Let's see. Uh, Can I start the romance? Yoga? Give a romantic gift. Is she, that's gonna really mess up our relationship if she won't accept it, though. <sighs> okay, I have a lot of stuff in my inventory. Let's give her. Let's 
shit or whatever on. this is. Oh. I don't know, you guys. Oh, I think I'm moving too fast, and she's not going to like it. Hi. Would you like to be Bazoo. Les with me? Uh -huh. oh. She likes it. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Things are happening. Yeah. Okay, now I'm feeling flirty, so let's keep the flirtation going. Once your character's feeling flirty, the flirts tend to be more successful. Does that make sense? Physical intimacy. Kiss hands. Let's just do it. You only live once. Okay, in The Sims, you live a lot of times. Let's just do it. Would you like to be a lesbian? Skiba Sluba. Okay, <laughs> bitch. Things are happening today. It's not exactly woohooing with Vlad, but... Sexy pose. You guys, oh, I love the Sims. It's, so, it's just so Ooh. stupid sometimes. <laughs> oh. Lesbian stuff, you guys. We're doing lesbian stuff. Ew. Oh, my God. Dick's Twitch says, yeah, kiss them fingies. That is such a weird thing to say. Kiss the fingies. All right. Offer Rose. Oh. Uh, you know, I'm not so trying to woohoo her. Place. Wait, let's pause. Let's see. Is there anything else I could do here that is like... <sighs> we could still befriend the Grim Reaper, but somebody has to die. Hmm. Well, some of these could stack. Like, drowning someone in a pool means the Grim Reaper will show up, and then I can become friends. You know what I mean? So, maybe I just go somewhere with a pool and take the ladder out. I mean, that's so classic Sims, but maybe that's the way to do it. Chimak. Let's focus. I need to try to get her to turn <laughs> into a vampire here. <laughs> Is there something vampire-y that can happen here? Lurbis. Maybe I, maybe I switch to playing as Lilith, and then I turn her into a vampire maybe that's the way to do it to be honest what do you guys think because how do you ask to be turned into a vampire i normally play as the vampire let me google let me google to that the great thing about the sims is you can just google how to do anything i mean even the sims website has cheats on it so it's not exactly like privy information how to become a vampire Okay, the first thing that comes up is how to become a vampire in real life. Um, okay. Not not really what I was looking for. Kind of spooky, to be honest. Let's see, shall we? Okay. So I'm still back here. Do you see me? I'm over here. Um, let's put it. Let's put me in front of it. There we go. How do you become a vampire in The Sims 4? There are multiple paths to vampirism in The Sims 4. Like I said, I've I have maxed out being a vampire, but I've never been the human asking to turn into a vampire. So the fastest way is to make one in the CAS. I think create a sim. That's cheating. Players should start with a new family. Blah, 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 blah. How to become a vampire. Let's see. Game Rant, help me. This is an unsolicited plug for Game Rant. By the way, we do have some giveaways today. Um, I'm going to start picking random people in the chat, and I'm going to ask questions. I'm going to ask trivia questions about, and you guys will have to answer them, and then whoever responds in the chat, I will pick them, and... That's it. I also will probably just pick random. If you guys have been on my stream before, you know that I just pick random people. Engage in friendly conversation with a sim and develop a friendship with them. After making friends with a vampire sim, your sim can ask them to become vampire through the ask to turn interaction. Okay, well, we are friends. So, it's time. Ask to turn. Friendly. It's probably in friendly. You guys, The Sims, there used to be so few interactions, and now it's so hard to find them. Okay. Actions? Uh-uh. It's not romance. It's not funny. It's got to be under friendly. 
<laughs> Small talk? No. I, you guys help me in the chat. I'm trying to figure out how to be asked to turn into a vampire here. Interest? Love the stream. Oh, thank you. It was fun blowing off my, like, headphones and getting a stream ready for you guys. Because we used to do this all the time. Dumpster woohoo with her. Wow. Oh, you need to build the friendship more. Okay, okay, okay. I guess we are kind of, like, too lesbian too fast. Maybe we can just have a platonic friendship. But if there's anything I know about lesbians, it's that... Platonic friendships can become more than that. Some of you know that intimately. Let's talk about deep thoughts. Um, let's just share ideas. Oh, yeah. We're building a friendship. <laughs> let's see. Toilet paper, one of the university statues. We could probably do that. I bet we just have to go to, well, I think we have to be a student, Walk. though. Uh -huh. All right, let's build up this friendship here. Trixie, stop walking away. Let's hold hands. That's a good way to build a friendship. Uh -huh. Caleb is sexy. I agree. I mean, this like kind of Adam Lambert hair isn't for everyone, but oh, do you guys see him? He's not bad looking. I mean, it's it's kind of it's hair. It, it's kind the hair is kind of John and Kate plus eight meets Cameron Esposito meets Rachel Maddow meets Adam Lambert, right? That's kind of what I see here, but would you come flirt, please? Let's go back, you guys. Thank you for joining here today. You know, we are going to do some giveaways here. I have Nick in the chat here. Basically, if you win, Nick is going to DM you and he is going to be giving you, uh, you know, giving you the items. So I guess the question I would like to ask to the group is, <laughs> let's see. Whoever can answer this the fastest is the international winner. Oops. I gotta think of it. All right. All right, all right, all right. What year? Did Electronic Arts launch The Sims Online? I'm watching the chat, and I will pick the one who says first. I will see it. I, oh, God, it's so fast. Oh, God. Oh, God. All of you are guessing 2000. That's a pretty good guess, but that's not it. Okay, Jules. Jules is high. You're the first one. At, wait. Oh, right before Jules. Jules, I'm sorry. Bob the Square 69 also said 2002. You know what? Let's award both of them. Bob the Square 69, Jules is high. We're going to DM you, and we're going to give you some codes here for expansion packs, fun stuff in The Sims. But, yes, it was 2002. I still remember the commercial. Do you guys remember the commercial of The Sims with, like, little bubbles above their head talking? And I remember the commercial was like, beware. The Sims are – it was, it was like, The Sims are wild now because The Sims were real people for a while, which was – Definitely crazier. Crazier. <laughs> All right. Wow. Now, this seem this stream is turning it's turning very lesbian. First kiss. <sighs> yeah. Oh. Kiss him away. <laughs> no. Come oh. on. Bad him away. Had this makes me think of it. Do you guys remember when we played The Sims? I don't know if you remember, but I played for a while and David and I were in The Sims and he was a vampire. Stuff. Doing stuff. Nice. Oh, Doing RGB. stuff. Awesome. Thank God. Okay, we're feeling very lovey dovey. Um, is there any woohoo? You have to woohoo Don Lothario or Vladislav Strahd. Vladislav Strahd. Maybe we can dumpster woohoo, though. Isn't dumpster woohoo one of them? Dumpster woohoo is one of them. You guys, maybe instead of becoming a vampire right now, we pause and try to go dumpster woohoo because I think this person will woohoo me. And wouldn't it be romantic if the first time was in a dumpster? Okay. Let's try to become a vampire first. Let's just – although when you first become a vampire, the gameplay gets a little more complicated. So let's try to go have the dumpster woohoo first. Let's see about traveling to – where is a neighborhood that definitely has a dumpster? Let's travel. 
Lilith, we're going. You guys, the one that came out with the um, eco-friendly pack, I believe, has a bunch of dumpsters. So let's go there, shall we? Did you get your DM going? Okay, great. We have tons of stuff to give away. The Sims, when they booked me for the stream, they gave me a lot of stuff to give away. So while we're traveling, why don't we do another little question here and don't cheat. Okay. All right. Which Sims game, one, two, three, or four, or online, had the medieval pack? Some of you should know this. This is like very base level game information. All right, I see one already. Harlow Blonde, you guessed first. It's number three. Medieval Sims is wild. That really could be like its whole own game. Um, I've not played The Sims 3 much in my life because I was, I mean, let's take you back. You guys got to imagine. I was in college. I mean, I, you know, I didn't exactly have time for The Sims 3 in the early 2010s. Um, I definitely had time for The Sims 2 because I was a high schooler um, and I apparently have time now. But I skipped a lot of The Sims 3, but I watched some deep dive like Carl Sims Guide videos on the Medieval Sims. And I was like, wow, this really is like its own world. All right. Let's go to the neighborhood where they recycle a lot because I know there's going to be lots of trash bins there. Evergreen Harbor. There's some really good worlds in here. Let's see. Um, where is there definitely going to be trash? That's a residential. Go somewhere public. This will have trash. By the way, isn't this overlay fun? This little like, do you see this little spinning flower behind me? Cute, right? My friend Joey did it, who does a lot of our packaging for Trixie Cosmetics. All right, first things first. Let's find a dumpster. Hi, dumpster. Let's get the dumpster woohoo going on. Where the dumpster at? Not my first time in my life I've looked for a dumpster to do this. Normally I do this behind a dumpster. Hello. Oh god, there's trash everywhere here. Maybe they don't have a dumpster. They're certainly not using it. Jeez. Where am I? Hmm. Where is a dumpster to woohoo in in this game? You guys, any, oh, is that one? Oh, there we go. Oh, she's ready for me, baby. She's right by the dumpster. <gasps> okay. Die for thrills with her. Why isn't that selectable? Oh, it's in use, she's already using it. Okay, let's walk over here. You guys, we're getting points, baby. We're getting some of these points. We are gonna dumpster woohoo if it's the last thing I do. Hi, Sarah. Hi, Trixie. Cecilia Kang has asked me out on a date. Should I say yes? I don't even know that person, but yeah, go for it. Offer a rose. Let's set the mood. Yeah, don't. Oh, umbrella, because she's outside. Would you move? We're trying to do lesbian lesbian stuff in, in the dumpster. Okay, I've never done this in the dumpster. This is thrilling. I love when the Sims get... Wait, pause. I love when The Sims get like a new like woohoo or a new death. It is so thrilling to see a new death or a new woohoo. This is not new, but I have not personally done this. So let's see what happens. Would you get out of here? Ooh, ooh lock. <laughs> Bemboy. Would, where did she go? Are you getting in here with me or not? This this perv needs to get out of here. <gasps> so if you're following along at home, people, we are taking a moment to woohoo with a vampire in a dumpster. If my mom could see me now, you know, this is really where we're at. Success. Thank you. Six faces of fat. Yes, we're finally doing it. Legs straight up in the air. Oh, my God. Somebody said, let's go dumpster lesbians. Let's go. That's the tea. Break out the candles, make it romantic. Trixie's about to woohoo for the first time in a dumpster. Isn't that beautiful? Well, if you guys know me, you know that I have a friend who lost his virginity in the parking lot of a Pride Festival using purple Gatorade as lubricant. So this is kind of par for the course. Yeah, keep walking, looky-loo. 
And if this doesn't make us close enough friends to become a vampire, I don't know what will, okay? Purple Gatorade? Girl, that's what I'm saying. Sounds like Milwaukee Pride. You know it was. Whose legs are those? Are those my legs? Wow. Doing stuff. All right, pause. It's time to become a vampire. This has to be an option, finally. Where would it show up under you guys? If anybody knows exactly where this action is, listen, we're 50 minutes into the stream. I've only accomplished one thing so far. I'm trying to get it going here. If anybody in the chat can help me, you're my actions. That's what I'm saying. Wouldn't it be under actions? But that's that's just for a group. Deep thoughts or interests. Okay, let's try that. Uh, talk about marriage. Wow, this is all moving so quickly. We just got out of the dumpster. Um... Deep thoughts. Confess. I don't have a fear of vampires, and I'm afraid of scaring her away, so. Interests? Ask about vampire history. Maybe I have to ask more, like, vampire questions. Ask risque questions. Ask to be a vampire. That's a good idea. Let's try that next. Everybody says it's under friendly. I think so, too. Our friendship's not high enough, but we're lezzing out. So, like, what is the truth? Oh, the friendship isn't good. Yeah. Okay. So let's just build up the friendship then. We'll do some nice, friendly interactions. Oh, I'm not patient, you guys. But I don't like cheating in this game. I feel like half of it is the playing of it, you know? Some people are big cheaters. Interest. We'll, 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 t we'll talk about decor. We're building a friendship. No more in the meanwhile, let's do another giveaway while they're building their little friendship here. Okay. More trivia questions. What is the one Sims expansion that is now completely defunct and not supported or playable? Come on. Everybody's guessing pets. Wow. There's so many there's there's so many questions. Come on, people. I'm staring. I still don't see it. You know, there seems to be... Let's get, let's get this question. You guys are getting too heated. We'll do another one. We'll do something with a, with a cleaner answer. Something with a cleaner answer. All right. Who is the developer of The Sims? I'm watching. I'm watching. I'm watching. All right, somebody got it. Glitch72, it's Maxis. Bing, 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 bing. Let's send you some lovely free items in the chat here and let's keep it going. Free items. Ah. All right, my friendship with her is not going fast enough. Let's just real quick, like, how to become friends the Sims. I normally end up having friends in The Sims organically. I've never like tried to sit here and force a friendship before. Glitch72, turn your whisper on. We're trying to DM you the code. What's the, you guys, anybody in the chat, what's the fastest way to be friends? I usually just end up, oh, cloud gazing. That's a good idea. Let's do that. You guys are basically helping me play The Sims. Thank you so much. Let's find, I think you need grass to do that. Where's some grass? Well, we don't need to be here anymore, so I guess we can also just go home. Let's see. What else is on our list, though? What else is on our list? What else is on our list? Okay, we did one dumpster woohoo. We have successfully did one thing. Gosh. Befriend an animal. That's kind of easy, but I can't get to this forgotten grotto, which is really upsetting. Oop. 
for him. Let's see. We really could just try to kill someone. <laughs> it all keeps coming back to murder. Do you guys notice? No matter what, I'm like, let's just kill someone. Um, I wonder if any of the Sims I know have that cow plant. I don't have a cow plant. Let's see. I think let's just c continue on trying to become a vampire, and that's like the next thing we could probably like actually get done here. So let's just be more friends. Let's go home though. Like this is too much. Or let's travel with her. Come on. Let's travel. This is my friend. This is my little friend, babes. Oh my God, would you cover in Simlish? That would be like one of my dreams. Would be to have a song in The Sims. You can go through the magic land and become a witch really quickly. That's true, but I really, I played the making, or not making magic. I played that one to death. I maxed out that. So I don't want to do witch again. Let's see. Let's go to, maybe I just want to be a witch. Let's go to Glimmerbrook because I'm pretty sure I can just go to the magic area. I think we can just go there and go walk over. I think that's the fastest way. I think you can either have someone teach you the ways of the occult, or you can actually go over to this little secret witch area. Maybe you need to be a witch to find that area. Do you guys remember? It's been so long since I played this world, to be honest. Why is it raining so bad? I think it's like over... It's over here. Haha. -ha. Let's bring my girlfriend. She's kind of my girlfriend now, so. Let's go be a witch. I mean, a witch is still lesbian. I feel like witch is, witch is just as lesbian as vampire, right? I mean, I don't make the rules. Be a mermaid. You know, I've never done the mermaid one because honestly, I kind of wish mermaids had more, like, I mean, being a, a witch in this game is amazing. Like, it's amazing. It helps the game a lot. Being a witch is honestly like the wholesome way of cheating. Where's my character? Would you move it along? Jeez. Oh my god, Nick just told me I could shower in the rain. Okay, okay. Let's do it. Shower in the rain. Shower in the rain. <gasps> We're completing things! Things are happening. Alright, we're gonna real quick shower in the rain. Do not run inside. Shower in the rain. Hi, I'm just naked. Don't worry. Okay. Number two on the checklist. Diva, get into her. So, so far we've gotten the woohoo in the trash can and we got the rain shower. Work. It's actually, okay. We're doing better than I thought it would, to be honest. Some of these are really involved. All right. Now let's go be a witch. Where's, wait, where's my little, there we go. Come on. I'm impatient. My character's gonna starve to death. That's okay. Enter the The swirling vortex appears to lead to a realm beyond our own reality. Do you care to cross the threshold? Yes, I do. Yes, I absolutely do. Fierce. We are in the magic realm. I believe this game, we keep calling it a witch, but I believe in the Sims world, it's called a spellcaster. I just wanted to be transparent about that. All right. How do I become a witch here? I don't remember if I have to ask someone or is it just this? Oh, I can cook mac and cheese. I am hungry. All right, before I become a witch, let's go make some mac and cheese in this giant pot. You guys, in the Sims, you have these giant, like, cauldrons that the spellcasters can use to make, like... Honestly, one of the most useful things about being a witch is just making a potion that fulfills your needs. It's a great way to not cheat, but kind of cheat. And basically, you can go cook mac and cheese in it, which I always find very funny. So we're going to do that, because I find that shit funny. Go to a sage. They have a symbol over their head. You're right. That is how you do it. 
I believe this is one here. Hi. Howdy. All right, we're gonna make mac and cheese first, though. All right, let's talk to her. Ebony Flurva. Hi. Hey, you guys, pause. These are the sages, the ones with the little symbol above their head. Those are the ones that help you advance your skills in magic. They're like, basically teachers. Uh, Ask how to use magic. We're doing it. Sorry, I gave up on being a vampire. Wix, Fibby. But think of it this way. If I was supposed to have a long, healthy relationship with my vampire girlfriend, let's just think about it this way, people. How would I have done that if my vampire, my girlfriend couldn't drink my blood? So at the end of the day, I'm kind of choosing love over being a vampire if you really think about it. So just, you know, something to think about, something to, you know, think about your consequences in life, all right? The butterfly effect. This is just good fun. Thank you, Jellybean. If you guys are new, I used to stream on Twitch so often, twice a week, I think, and it was so fun, and Sims was definitely definitely in our rotation. So thank you to The Sims for having me here to celebrate the 24th birthday of The Sims. Feather Stonery says, I love witchy shit. You do? Well, we are gonna, um, Nick, do we have a code for this expansion? If we do, this is honestly one of my favorite ones. I mean, I'm kind of a, I'm this type of person. This is one of my favorite packs. I just, this was one of the only packs where I really played through all of it. I like achieved everything you could achieve. Um, it was really, really fun. Loved playing this one through. Trixie, you look stunning. Oh, stop, thank you. Oh, Deli's here, you guys. One of the most famous Sims content creators is here. Deli, who hit, I'm not even gonna try to do her accent. Deli, if you're in the chat, I know your accent's wild, but there's something about your accent. It, it's like, I love watching her Sims videos because it's like a velvet blanket on my ears. It's very calming, that accent. I like love it. I just, I don't want to be expose myself as like an untrained idiot because I can't tell exactly what region of the world she's from, but it's so magical. It's a great, 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 it's a great accent. I love your stream so much. Oh, thank you. You know, um, Deli's an amazing creator. And you want to talk builders, you guys? I don't want to get like, the reason, honestly, there's so many amazing builders in The Sims that it's almost intimidating. Because the way David Silver plays The Sims is he basically builds only. And I've never been a builder because, listen, you've seen my HGTV show. Okay, you know that I'm not an incredible builder myself. And even in The Sims, I find it to be difficult. So, Deli, if you're just watching us, we have The Sims, uh, basically a bunch of challenges for the 24th birthday. And we currently had, we, we had woohoo, I almost had sex. Woohoo in a dumpster. Uh, we had woohoo in the dumpster. We showered in the rain, and now we're about to become an occult sim. And I think after that, we broke into a sim's house, so. oh, I broke into a sim's house, so we're at four. I think after that, we should try to. I mean, do I have to play as the same? Because I could become one of the celebrity sims and then fight the paparazzi. Because I'm not famous, so the paparazzi aren't gonna. Not gonna bother me. Make a thousand simoleons from a side hustle. You guys, I've played side hustles. You don't exactly make a thousand dollars per hustle, so that one would probably take a while. We could still wait for a death and try to become friends with the Grim Reaper. That's probably what we're gonna do next, to be honest. So let's uh Gather Oh, I think I'm yes. becoming an occult sim finally. Learning the magical arts is a wonderful and perilous journey. Are you sure you're prepared to become a spellcaster? Should we do it, guys? Let's sound off in the chat. Should we do it or should we go be a vampire? I've also not been a werewolf in this game either. I've definitely been a robot. I've definitely been a spellcaster. I've definitely been a vampire. Spellcaster, like I said, that's the one that you actually, I feel like you get the most benefit from because the potions you can create really help your gameplay. Witch, please, right? Let's do witch. Werewolf is also fierce. Maybe we'll switch Sims and go be a werewolf and we'll take two points for that one. Let's do it. All right, very focused. Does Nico's Karenzi. 
<sighs> Dirty flirty. First kiss. We're doing good. We're still having some issues with uh, my unfulfilled dreams, but hey, in some ways, The Sims is a lot more like real life than you think. Let's eat some mac and cheese, though, because I think my character is very hungry. All right, while we're making mac and cheese, let's take a look here. Mm. Befriend an animal. I mean, that's not a that that could be pretty reasonable. Start a fire. I believe there's a spell for that. Do you guys know? Is anybody in chat aware if there's a in, is there an in-game cow plant or do I have to produce it myself? Because I currently don't have a cow plant. Otherwise, that one seems pretty easy. I've never played The Sims before. Ponya says, uh, it's great. And like I said, you guys, the base game for The Sims is available currently for free. So go ahead and get the base game. The base game is great. You guys are watching me play with a lot. I have, I think I have every pack except the new one, the goth one. I think that's the only one I don't have. So, you know. But the base game is great. Go scoop it up for free. It's a great, great game. I'm just fast forwarding because I'm trying to eat this mac and cheese. Cause, girl, I'm not doing well. Dag, dag. Oh, I say let's do another giveaway, shall we? I'm gonna do something unprecedented, which is just pick some people in the chats, and we're just gonna send it to you. So, oh, Slayer Chick 303, girl, you are getting a prize. Congratulations. All right, all right, all right. Uh -uh. Am Jones, Am Jones arms. 9, A I N J O N E S 9. Sir Hello. <laughs> I'm going to have Nick send you a little prize as well. And then for a third giveaway, let's pick. Embo. Oh my gosh. Infaliness. Hello, Ronnie Resplendent Bayou. Queen. I don't even know what that one means. So, Anna Leash, A N E L E I S H. We're going to give you a code too. By the way, Jamaka. thanks to The Sims for giving me stuff to so give away. I love giving free items away. Bruhana. My character's getting very tired. Not going to nap on a park bench. Not this. What is she so mad about? She only needs to get over it. Well, now we're in occult sim. Let's see. I wonder. I haven't played as an occult sim in a while. I, I don't recall what the spell casting process is like. I really did play this character. When I played, I picked one of the games, one of the characters in the game that starts as like a low level witch and I like made that go all the way up to the top. I didn't, I don't think I've ever become a witch from scratch before, which means I probably have zero skills. I could go back to, well, I could go to, you know what we should do? We could probably go pause what we probably could do we probably could go to outside one of the celebrities homes and wait for paparazzi and then just fist fight them i think that sounds fun i think that sounds like an easy way to get that one off the list too so why don't we just do it i say let's just do it by the way uh while i'm sleeping i just want to show you guys this lot this lot is amazing look at this look how beautiful this like witch school is in this game so cool, right? There's a portal here. There's a portal here. Portal here. Caster's Alley, you guys, that's basically like uh, where all the extra witch stuff is. Like stores, stuff where you can go buy like cauldrons and potion ingredients and stuff like that. But let's see, it's time. Do I have enough sleep yet? Can we just wake up? Yeah, we're good. All right, it's time to wake up. Let's go to one of the celebrities' houses over in, uh... I'm gonna show you guys this world that's supposed to be based on Los Angeles. I'm just gonna say it's a lot cleaner than Los Angeles. But it does look like Los Angeles, so let's go over there. Am I here with my girlfriend still? Yeah, let's bring her along. Come on. Alright, in class I'm watching your stream. German, you're not supposed to be doing that. Put one of the Sims in Sims Jail. Add your girlfriend to Social Bunny. That's a good idea if we're trying to build up that friendship. But I guess now we already did the occult sim thing. So if you guys see Del Sol Valley, this is supposed to be Los Angeles. Let's read the about. It says, join the glitz and glamour of Del Sol Valley. 
uh, New World where your sims discover fame. This came with the Get Famous pack, I believe. It might not be called Get Famous. That's what I remember it being called. Get a starter home in Mirage Park or work your way up to a house in the hills. Might as well. I loved this pack when it came out. This household right here, Miss Jong, I played as her and I played as her for a while. Um, I had a really good time playing as her. So let's go to, where's the rich people? This is a celebrity home, so let's go here. And I hope they'll just be paparazzi outside and we can just fight one of them. And that means we will have completed five of these. Which I'm very proud of because I thought these were gonna be, some of them were gonna be a lot harder than they are. I mean, it's just problem solving, I guess. Let me add her on social bunny. Do I do, do I, I think I do that on here. Oh, I think I do have to add her. I do have to add her. Okay, let's add her. Let's see, is it under friendly? Do you guys know where the add to social bunny is? This is a new one for me. I have only just started using social buddy because before my character was a doctor, she was a social media influencer. So it's kind of new for me. If you guys are experts, could you help? In the app, the phone. Girl, in the app on the bottom. Okay, sorry. The person who invented autocorrect died today. Restaurant in peace. You guys, the comedy of The Sims knows no end. I ordered a chicken and egg online. I'll let you know which comes first. I can't stand this game sometimes, you guys. That is so stupid, but very funny. Okay, where's the ad? Okay. Okay, here we go. It's my new girlfriend. Let's uh, send her a friendly message. We're trying to build the friendship. Okay, let's send another one. Can you just spam this and that's how you can become a quick friend? Again, there's so many things in The Sims where it's not quite cheating, but, you know. Let's make a new post. Post about uh, a happy narrative. Might as well, right? A happy narrative about being home from work. Love. Social bunny. All right, this is this famous person's house. I don't see any paparazzi. I guess the other option would be to, in this kind of like Del Sol Valley, maybe go to. Should we just go knock? Oh, I am friends with her. I could just go say hi. Did I accidentally remove her? Sorry. 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 Come back to me. My lover. This my lover. Send her a message. Flirt. Keep the love alive. Girl, Lilith really does like exercise. Every time I turn my head, she's out here just exercising. Paparazzi? Oh! You're a witch. And you flew away. All right. Where do I find paparazzi in this game? You guys, this is a nice little challenge because honestly, some of these challenges I would not have thought about. Like, where is paparazzi in this game if not outside some famous person's house? I guess I could go to one of the social lots in this world and try to look for paparazzi there. How about this house, you guys? Isn't this fierce? Wow. Sickening. It's like Vanderpump's house. Go to the social bar and there will, oh, go to a social, you guys are a genius. Go to a, a social place. I'm gonna invite my famous friend and paparazzi will show up. You guys are smart. Let's see, let's travel. Judith is my famous friend. I wonder if she'll come and let's bring Lilith. Vlad hates me, so I think that ship has like completely sailed. Um, let's just invite him anyway. Maybe I'll just slowly become friends with them and I could start flirting with them. 
Um, again, if you guys are just joining, I'm Trixie. We're celebrating the 24th uh, birthday of The Sims, and we are in the middle of trying to complete many of these challenges. So far, we showered in the rain, we woohooed in a dumpster, we broke into a home, we transformed into an occult sim, and we're trying to currently fight the paparazzi. Um, I have been paparazzi. You guys, I – wait. I actually have a paparazzi video of myself that I will show on this stream. I wonder if I can just, like – like look for it but there's a paparazzi video of me just like ignoring them and they're they're following me taking pictures of me uh it was at the queerty awards it was outside of chateau marmont let's see if i can find it it was one of the only times i've really gotten good and like surprised by cameras but i just kind of ignored them see if I can find it. Tracy Nadal. Uh, where was it? It was, I think it was at Chateau Marmont. No, it wasn't. Uh, I'm trying to find, finding, I'm trying to find my own paparazzi video. I can't find it. I mean, I'm, wait, maybe it's like, Trixie Mattel. You guys don't even believe me. You guys are like, you are not famous enough. It happened a few times, okay? It did happen once, too, when we were filming season one of Trixie Motel. They showed up outside the motel, and I had to ask them to leave. But I'm the owner of the property, so it's a lot easier when it's your property, and you can just be like, get the hell out of here, you know? I can't find it. You guys are just going to have to believe me. There was one time in my life where I got paparazzi, and it's only a funny video because basically it's me and David walking into, I think, the Queerty Awards, and I'm in full drag, and he's walking next to me, and sometimes um, David and I have watched it and laughed because next to me walking, he's like this big, and we just, we, we do look humorous. We do. Trixie Googling the Trixie Mattel paparazzi. I know. It's funny. Breaking, former Sim celebrity turned doctor, Trixie Mattel, MD, found hunting for paparazzi to fight. Girl, that's exactly what's going on. Okay, so right now we have me, my vampire girlfriend, my famous friend, and my vampire who hates me. So let's go to a public lot and let's just, let's see. There's a studio lounge. These are all hot spots. This is the like Oscar museum. So I feel like they will be there. Let's try there. Let's just try there, shall we? My vampire hates me. I know. I can't get over how gorgeous you look. Thank you. You know, let's take a moment, you guys. I do look really beautiful today. I do. This makeup is gorge. I'm actually, if you guys are in Los Angeles, I'm DJing tonight at High Tops Los Feliz for this party called Champion. I am DJing later. So if you want to come link up with me. You want the food. All right. Where are the pops? Where are the pops? I guess I'll just hang out with her and maybe they'll show up. Who's, oh, oh, oh! First of all, this little girl needs to go. Oh, it's a fan. Okay. Second of all, let's fight. Do I have to be famous to fight the paparazzi? Let's do a rude introduction. Maybe I have to have a bad relationship with her. I wonder if this one only counts if you are the celebrity. Look at everyone's freaking out. It's like when I go to Sephora. Look, that person fainted. Sometimes you're so famous the fam the Sims faint, which is pretty fierce. Would you? Let's rudely introduce ourselves. Oh, dag, dag, dag. I have no issue with being mean to paparazzi. Whenever I've done, um, like, whenever I've done, like, Jimmy Kimmel and stuff, and I see there's usually a paparazzi behind Jimmy Kimmel, like, taking pictures of you while you go in the studio, and I always just give him the finger or something. Um, all right. Let's fight her. Is shoving count? Let's do it. Ooh, I don't like fighting. You're not even the Sims. I, even in the Sims, I'm non confrontational, you guys. I don't feel bad, you guys. They're leeches. They're all leeches. Celebrities just, you know, they're digging up the of the celebrity. Shout for Oh, 
Oh, oh. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, I'm not apologizing. I'm just here to insult people. Oh, another celebrity. Girl, don't make me fight you. I gotta fight her. Throw a drink, bitch. Let's go. If you guys have never seen The Sims fight, it's pretty amazing. It's like the most cartoonish, like, cat fight. Oh, there was nothing in the cup. Well, that's fine. Fight! 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 Our fifth one. All right, come on, baby. Look at everyone's flipping out because these celebrities are here. Oh, no, 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 no. You're not getting away that easy. We're fighting. Do you guys see her just trying to walk away? Not on my watch, bitch. Let's go. I... Look at that. No, no, no respect for human life. Camera's not. Did it. And I won the fight. Sickening! I can't believe we did five of these. That is fabulous. It's time for another giveaway, shall we? All right. This time, I think we should do some good old-fashioned drag race trivia because I actually know stuff, okay? I actually know stuff. All right. In, okay. In RuPaul's Drag Race All-Stars uh, Season 1, Nina and Tammy are on a team together. What is the team name? This is a deep cut. I hope you guys know this one. Oh my gosh, somebody got it right away. Queer rights and wrongs. Got it. It's brown flower. You better work, bitch. I'm going to pick the first few that got it. Uh, Queen, you got it. Uh, it's queer rights and wrongs, Nick. And then call me Moonlight. You also got it, which is pretty impressive. Impressive. And then Francis underscore, underscore not Scott. You also got it. All three of you got it. That's some deep drag race knowledge. You guys are very impressive people. Damn, I can't type that fast. Girl, people are in here. Oh my God, somebody said fat fingies. I hate the word fingy. I don't like that. Fingy. All right. So we have done five of these, which is really sickening. Let's see. Um, start a fire. What's the easiest way to start a fire in this game? The only way I've done it in the past is when my Sims has a very poor cooking skill and I'm in a bad mood. Like, that's how I've always done it, but I bet there's got to be an easier way to do it. What do you guys think in the chat? Like, what's the... Oh, get a campfire and light it. Does that count, or does it have to be, like, a house fire? You guys think a campfire counts? Fireworks on carpet. That is a good idea. Campfire on a rug. I know burning food is hard, though. I could cast a fireball, but I don't think I have that skill level yet. Where is my occult skin? Occult sim skills. I don't remember where they are. Are they in here? I don't exactly remember where my occult occult sim skills are. I have not played as an occult sim in a while. Because where are my occult skills? Let's see. Moonbathe? I have not seen that one. Let's just see what that is, first of all. Am I just gonna get naked? No. I thought. Why did I think it was gonna be naked? <laughs> Look at. Wait. All these people around. Is just. <laughs> Look at. 
That is so stupid. This should be one of the... I'm going to put my own little spin on this list. I think moonbathing moon bathing with three celebrities around you should be one of them. That is so stupid. That is so dumb. That's just me on a Saturday night. Oh my god, two. Why is she laying on the ground? She's moonbathing. All right? You're just planking, pretty much. Yes. <laughs> oh, I'm not a witch yet because I didn't collect the moats. That's right. I was like, why hasn't this? All right, well, that's probably not the fastest way to start a fire. So let's say... I guess we're going to travel again. Let's go somewhere that has a campfire. I think... Does a campfire count? Is that cheating? Where do you... Do you guys remember... Where do you buy fire fireworks? Let's see. But I think fireworks on carpet is the smart thing. Where to buy fireworks The Sims 4. If anybody's just joining, hi. We've been playing for a while. We're trying to complete this checklist of really wild things to do for The Sims' 24th birthday. Fireworks can be bought from a stand that appears in buy mode. To find a fireworks stand, enter buy mode and scroll down to outdoor activities. Okay. Let's try to buy some fireworks. And, we're for, and by the way, if we're starting a fire, we're not doing it at my house. Fly mode. Shemaney. Let's see. By the way, can I just say, if anybody plays The Sims, do you see this search bar? I did not know this existed for a long time. This is by far the easiest place to find things. That's not right. For outdoor, I guess. Hmm. Not off the grid. You guys, where would fireworks be in this menu? Activities and skills, that's what I think. Toilet. Okay, queer rights and wrongs is really coming through. Apparently, we can go to San Ryoshino and we can find the talking toilet. So we could go do that too. How much time do we have? We have 30 more minutes left in the stream. Do you think we can start a fire and do that? I think we can. Is this a firework? That's a rocket ship, and I can't use it to level 10. I think it's under outdoor activities. Let's see. They're probably not called fireworks in this game. That's probably why I can't find it. Well, there's the campfire. We could just buy this and just start it and call it a day. But I think it should be a real fire. Let's see. By the way, I talked about this in uh, t uh, yesterday's YouTube video, but one of the best things about The Sims is the product description. I know I'm blocking it, but the descriptions of these products are so funny. Say, oh my god, at this point, tricks the Sims of the Sims. Where's fireworks? Is that a firework? No, wow, there's so many new items. I have not played with the marbles, that's cool. I cannot even find the fireworks, you guys. It, we could just do the fire pit and call it a day. But I can't probably place this here because it's not my lot. Yes, it is. I can place it. Work. We're going to call this starting a fire. Okay. It's it's fine. I mean, technically, it's starting a fire. Do you guys think I'm a cheater? It says starting a fire. I think that counts, personally. Oh, not Lilith stealing my job. She was on fire. She flopped anyway. Did it. Did it. All right, my character's getting tired, so I think we are going to have to go take a nap quick. Because I am not a cheater like some of you. Let's 
let's go home and take a power nap. And then we're going to go over to Sam Miyashino and talk to that talking toilet. So right now that's, let's see, where's my travel? Honestly, I think, I was thinking about this yesterday because I was putting the stream together and I was kind of reflecting on the Sims in general. And I was like, it is amazing that this game is, you know, we'll give Lilith some time off. I need to be on my own. All of you. It is amazing that this game has gone for so long. And I think part of it is because this is a game where you can either, you know, do what I'm doing now and give yourself a bunch of objectives. Or honestly, you can like kind of just play the whole game without really any objective. Because some people play The Sims by only building. If you're like me, I usually pick a family that comes with a, 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 a pack and just play with them. Because I like to kind of like the lore of The Sims, like kind of like a storyline. I like that type of thing. So, let's go home and sleep quick. And let's do some giveaways, shall we? All right. Um, you can buy fireworks on a computer. Well, now we already did. We already did the fire thing, so I've kind of moved on from that. I used to run my own seasons of Sims Big Brothers. We have done that too. We've done Drag Race. If anybody remembers during COVID, sound off in the chat, we were like fully doing Drag Race. We had an entire workroom with a runway. People would lip sync for their life. It was it was like we were doing our own all-stars. So, and by the way, if you guys haven't seen my newest YouTube video, I just want to take a minute to show you, this is my home. I live in this beautiful pink trailer. gorge right I mean it's not bad like for my character it's really all I need I live alone you know and to be honest if anybody's an experienced simmer knows this a bigger house is often a problem like if you're just trying to be efficient have your sim move into a box that has a bed a small fridge a microwave like just to meet your needs so you can go back to work it's kind of how I lived through my 20s to be honest all right Let's do another giveaway, shall we? Um, what pop star had a pack in The Sims? That's easy. Oh, somebody got it. All right. Stewie Crom, S-T-E-W-E-Y Crom, said Katy Peru. <sighs> There's a typo. And the next one says Katy Pretty. I don't think I can accept either of those. The winner is my T my T E E F H my Teef Hurdy said Katy Perry. So you win. You're the international winner. I can't accept typos, you guys. We have to have a nice clean fight here, okay? I also want to show you guys something. I was reminiscing the other day about the Sims, and I was kind of doing a deep dive on some of the Sims promos. The Sims 2 trailer was so cool. Does anybody remember this? Hold on. This is some old, old, old school Sims. But let me try to see here. Yeah, my teeth hurt. You need to turn on your whispers. That would be wonderful if you could turn on your whispers. Please. Please turn on the whispers. <laughs> Let's see. I'm just going to screen capture this so you guys can see this. Oh my god, giant, giant YouTube. We're just going to watch it this way. I'm also here, as you know, but, you know. I'm here. Let's see. I'm floating over here, apparently. Let's move me over here. Okay, let's watch. Games. Challenge everything. Love this trailer. Huh? This is, a, okay, so uh, this was The Sims 1 turning into The Sims 2. It was yeah. so cool. <laughs> what am I? Hey, hello, I'm like last. Got your reason. Oh, The Sims 2 is so good. Got a good reason for keeping it together. Said I got a good reason. Thinking to me, cause I'm doubling up. And I'm not gonna be just a reason. Keeping it real with my core and my form. 
Fierce, right? The Sims 2 opening was really good, too. When you would boot up the game, it had a really good, like, theme to it. Let's watch it. Oh, yes! This was also so good. Do you guys remember this? Anybody old enough remember this? This is so good. Love. Love. Yes, she's in charge of the girl. She's in charge of the girl. Love. Oh yeah, yoga. You guys gotta remember, pause. This was like the 2000s, mid 2000s, so yoga was like, just starting to be like a big thing. Oh God, wait a minute. The Sims 2 literally had some of the worst dancing done by Sims. It is like the, exclusively the stupidest. Like, exclusively the stupidest things. Oh my gosh. Well, my character's still sleeping, you guys. You haven't missed much, but we almost, has a, we almost have a full bar here so we can go accomplish our last task. We have about 20 minutes. So, um, I'm gonna consult with my crackpot team. Uh, I gotta go to San Miyashino, right? Okay, San Miyashino came out with the pack where it's basically apartments. That was fun. Like, when the game basically invented apartments and you could have neighbors, loud neighbors, apartments with bad wiring, like, you know, that's when the, I love San Miyashino. So let's go over there. Let's wake me up. Good morning, honey. It's time to wake up. Tense? Tense from what? Missing out on dreams? Go by. Get over yourself. That's how I'm with my friends, too. Well, okay. Let's go. Let's call my own. You know... We are getting more friends, though. Oh, she hates me. The paparazzi hates me. I'll go by myself. I'll go by myself. I'm going to go by myself. Now, you guys, we still are trying to complete here. We're still trying to get one of these in the next 20 minutes because the stream ends at 6. So I'm trying to get this done in the last 20 minutes because that means we will have done... The woohoo in the dumpster, we broke into a home, we fought the paparazzi, we transformed into an occult sim, we started a fire, and this would be number six. I didn't think I was gonna, I was literally talking to Nick yesterday, I was like, what'd you say? And I showed in the rain, that's seven, right? If you guys are counting better than me, that's seven, right? Yesterday I was looking at this list being like, do the sims people know how hard some of these are? Like, you can't just, you know, these aren't, some of these are not easy. Bring Patchy the Scarecrow to life. I don't even know how to do that. So that could be for the future. All right. But I love these kind of challenges for streamers because streamers who do The Sims all the time, I, I watch a lot of Sims streams, and I know sometimes because this game is a sandbox, you almost have to give yourself goals. It's a lot like life in that way. Um, let's go to San Miyashino. Is it a park, Nick? Where's she at? You guys, this world is cool. So all these skyscrapers have like apartments and you can get apartments next to other apartments. Which one? Uptown District. Okay, this is Uptown. Stargazer Lounge, right? This must be right, you guys. We're learning! I will say this, the longer you play The Sims, it's like the longer you play, the more you realize you don't know. Like, you know, I played this game for... Let's see if it's... Tw for 24 years, I guess. Although, to be fair, I probably didn't get this game right when it came out. I probably got it a few uh, years later. But I remember playing The Sims 1 in like... In like 2000, I remember playing it, so... All right, where is the talking toilet in this game? Converse. Friendly chit chat. Okay. I didn't even know this existed. Mefwa. Nahara Oberoi. Hi, Neve. Good day. Shut up. 
Well, do I have to become friends with it? I do, right? I have to become friends. So, so this is going to take a second. Can I add the toilet on, on social money? <laughs> you know, there's been times in my life where I've been in drag um, at a gay club. Maybe talking to no one in the toilet. So this isn't, this isn't impossible. Let's keep chatting, I guess. Friendly chit chat. Let's look at my relationships. The toilet is literally on here. That is so stupid. Sims, you're going to jail for this. You <laughs> The fact that this the fact that the toilet can be your friend, let's share our anxieties. I think some of you know that nothing brings people closer together than sharing their anxieties. We're having a private conversation. Do not use this toilet. Huh. Alfonso or Kanaya? Huvune. And Fora. Lemtim Yanabi. Right. Shusha Flamon. We're getting there. What are you laughing about over there? <laughs> Suli -suli. I know. Huh. That, you guys, I want you to remember yeah. that I'm arguably huh. one of the most yeah, famous sunny. drag queens in the world, and you guys are here watching oh, me talk to a big toilet. <laughs> <laughs> Gay people can do anything. <laughs> Gay people do anything, but shit. Okay, all of you get out of here. I don't care about being friends Bempi, with you, I care about the rig. toilet. Janib Shrofa. Seneke. Hibane, Glinok, kiss him. Oh. Uh -huh. Stop talking to them. Those aren't your friends. The toilet is your friend. Panabisu. <laughs> uh. Dreams do come true. Oh my god, totally. Uh. Did you guys see that? Water started shooting out and then. She turned the she turned the bidet on and then sat down. I think we know what that means becoming friends with the toilet let's see yes yes friends with the toilet eat it all right we have 15 more minutes we could actually maybe finish another one now that is fierce all right just to recap we're friends with the toilet we woohooed in the dumpster we broke into a home we showered in the rain we became an occult sim we fought the paparazzi um oh gosh okay There's a Japanese food stand in San Mayashino, right? Yeah. And that's where I can go try the puffer fish. Yeah. Girl, we're going to get eight of these. That is sickening. I'm so pleased with myself, you guys. I didn't think we were going to finish this many. This is really cool. I, I feel accomplished in a way where I never feel like that in my career. This feels like something. It feels like I really did something. All right. Look, see, this whole district, you guys, is like skyscrapers. So cool. I gotta go to where they sell food. I think I have to travel again. Should we bring a friend? Let's bring our lesbian girlfriend. Although it might be sunny outside. Which is perfect. My hunger's going down, so hopefully we'll have a chance with this puffer fish. Do you guys know about this? This might be fake, but I played the game, uh, I played another game called hitman and in the game you serve someone a fish that if it's not prepared properly it can be highly poisonous is this real is that a real thing all right where is the go to the gym okay queer rights and wrongs is really the whisperer of this game thank you for helping us i mean i was googling but i have gloves on i can barely type so Okay, so apparently this fish can kill you. Um, what a great way to end the stream, uh, if that's what happens. Let's see. That's a bathroom. Maybe the food vendors are only out here during the day. I don't see anybody. Do you guys see it? Right? Isn't there supposed to be food vendors out here? Chat, do I have to be out here during the day to get the fish? It's up, to, it's to the left. Queer Rights and Wrong says, look for a... Go to the Spice Festival. It's the Spice District. 
Hmm. Maybe it is the spice district. Let's try. Come on, girlfriend. Wow, that person's having a great time on the treadmill. I haven't been able to run in weeks, you guys. It's been horrible. My runner's knee are, is so fierce. All right. Spice District. Let's see. That's a residential lot. It must be here. Let's try here. So many of these lots, I honestly, like, even in The Sims, I'm career-driven. I end up just, like, playing Sims to their max careers and then moving on. I don't know why that's what I like doing, but... We all play the Sims differently. It's okay. Where's our food vendor friend? Is this it? Where's the bathroom? Is this it? It's not this one, is it? No, that's produce. You guys, I have 10 minutes. The bathroom. You could just go to the Japanese inspired world. Let's see. Uh, da -da 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 Fast forward to midday. That's what I'm saying. I think it has to be later in the day for food vendors. It needs to be day. Yeah, that's what I thought. What's your cooking level? You can make it yourself. You know, my cooking level's not bad, but I don't think it's that great. Two. I mean, that's not horrible. By the way, little tip in The Sims, if you want to avoid starting your hearts on fire, basically until you get through cooking level one, just make salads. Like, don't do anything with heat because you will start your house on fire. The Sims yeah. loves to start your house on fire. Yeah. Is this is the ah. no Maybe it's this one. No, this is Indian food. Wow. I'd love some curry right now. Ugh. Is he busking? No. Okay. You guys. Where is this vendor? I can't trust any of you. I'm going to have to Google to this. Let's see. Um. Nigiri Fish Sims. How to cook the poisonous nigiri fish. You have to go to the Japanese food stalls in San Miyashino. Which food stalls, Mary? Okay, it's a white... It's a white food place. Where to find the puffer fish nigiri? Okay. Yeah, it's a white stall. I don't see it, you guys. This doesn't look like it. Oh my god. I'm running out of time. I have 10 minutes. Can I just go to the bathroom? Maybe. They don't always sell it. It's in Uptown? Are you sure? Let's try. I think you're right, because it's definitely not here, is it? I mean, if we can complete one more, I think that's like eight. Let's try to do it, love. Don't you dare go to the bathroom. I just joined the stream. I meant in the game. Go to the gym again. I think that might be a, a good idea because I think it might switch up. Let's see. It The stall is in the fashion district. Girl, we'll try that if it's not here. We will try that next. Oh my gosh. I'm supposed to quit at six, you guys, but I'm not quitting until I get this goddamn thing. Okay. There's no food st Is this it? That's the bathroom. Oh! Is that it? No! I'm so over it, you guys. I hate, I love accomplishment, but I hate being challenged. So what do I do? I don't think it's here. Let's go over to I think we should try the fashion district, honestly. Slayer Chick says, we can, you can do it, Trixie. We believe in you. Thank you. 
Will you be streaming more often? I really miss it. I really, really miss it. This is such a fun game for streaming too because there's so much you can do. Is it here you think? No. Let's try this. We'll try the fashion district, you guys. If you're just joining us, we're just toward the end of the stream, but we're trying to complete a bunch of these and we're just not quite there yet. So I hope we can just find this fish. What is my character wearing? Pause everything. I forgot about my workout outfit. Do you guys want to see my workout outfit? Hey, ho. Is this it? Is this it? That looks like burgers, doesn't it? Yeah, that's not it. Shoop, is that it? That looks like it, but it doesn't look open. I'm gonna start screaming, you guys. It's like, it's like Maxis and The Sims and EA got together and said, we will not let her win. Oh, oh, it opened. And if the fish is... Uh, thank, yes, thank you. Welcome to work. Some of us have been waiting. My God, it's My God. If, I, if, this is, if the stream ends with me dying for this pupper fish... I'm out. I mean, I'm out anyway, but I'm really out if that's how I go down. Jeez, that is so funny. Oh my god, Jay, Jay Heidel says, this is the most exciting moment of my life. Me too. Girl, where are you? Yes. Eating meat brings sadness to the soul. That's right, I'm a vegetarian. Girl, get over it. Hmm. Are you gonna eat? If she won't eat it because I'm a vegetarian, I'm gonna lose my mind. Huh? Oh, Go sit and eat, girl. Would you eat the food, Mary? No, you don't need to be chatting. You need to be eating. You guys, I'm tr No, I, I did not win. She has to eat the fish for it to, for me to win. Where did the food go? Eat the food, Mary. Am I gonna wait a minute? Death is inevitable. Trixie knows that. Trixie just didn't think she would be thinking about it so soon. There's still so much to do. How will Trixie get everything done if death is just around the corner? Well, that's one of my fears. Okay, I was like, did I really just die from this? Could you guys imagine if I just died after you know what? I did accomplish a lot in my life. We spent the last two hours accomplishing goals, so Oh sh wait. Serve though. Who is she? Eight. Right? That's an outfit. Look how dumpy I look. I look like Regina George's mom, and she looks amazing. Damn. You need to buck up, Buttercup. We ate the fish. We ate the fish. I mean, we did something. All right, so if we're following along at home, we did. Shower in the rain, break into a Sims home, fight the paparazzi, eat that weird fish, Transform into an occult sim, start a fire, and is that it? Befriend the talking toilet. So we accomplished seven. I think that's pretty amazing. Like, dumpster. yeah, dump, dumpster woohoo. Wait, I just got to go through here. Start a fire, occult sim. Break into a home, shower in the rain, dumpster woohoo, befriend the talking toilet, eat, pufferfish. eat the pufferfish. It's seven. I, that is so much better than I thought it would be. 
You're an outcast. You da your dastardly deeds have alienated you from polite society. Well, we don't have to read that fiercely. Huh? Oh, I gotta move my checklist, sorry. This honestly reminds me of DJing, because you guys, if you've ever seen Solid Pink Disco, I do visuals at the same time, and you kind of need to like pay attention to what's on the screen. All right. You're an outcast. Your dastardly deeds have alienated you from polite society, but we don't care about all that. We value results. You're a criminal at heart. I can see that in you. So I'll, intend I'll extend you an offer. If you're interested in joining the criminal career, try you guys, should we just ditch being a doctor and be a criminal? We've been through so much. I think it's time we take back what the world owes us. What do you think? Let's see. It's a lot of yeses. Nobody's saying no. Everybody's saying yes to organized crime, so let's do it. I got to get good at mischief. Let's start by messing with this kid because you guys know how I feel about children. Deception. Pranks. I'm just gonna scare this kid. Love. 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 Hey, lady. Ooh, mischief? Not so much. Trixie doesn't feel bad of all these tricks and games. Should she turn over a new leaf and accept that she dislikes mischief? Uh, no. That would not be very conducive with my career now, would it? You guys, let's do a couple last-minute giveaways here. I think we could do some giveaways. Um, all right. All right, the maid in The Sims. There's a maid who is a skeleton. What is her name? What is her name? Okay, we do have it. Well, a lot of people responded. The first correctly spelled one was... Mr. W7257, Bone Hilda, you better watch this thing. We're going to DM you a little prize. Alright guys, I'm going to step off for one second. We're going to finish this stream on a high point. So I will be BRB, BRB. You guys, thank you for oh, oh my god, I forgot that's what we were watching. That really scared me. I was like, what? I'm like, what are we? Hello? You guys, thank you so much for joining me and watch joining me and watching me today. I just wanted to say happy, happy birthday for 24 years of The Sims over at Maxis and EA. And this game really is prolific and amazing and kind of in a lot of ways invented the like life simulation sandbox experience as we know it. And I actually think they don't get enough credit for that, honestly. Like it's a very impressive feat that a game like this has gone through so many iterations, so many packs. I mean it's, it's And if you have to think about it, I don't know how many people in the chat are queer. I'm assuming a lot of you. A game like this in the like 90s, 2000s, for it to even be an option to have a female on female or male on male or whatever a relationship was such a big deal. And I don't think we talk about that enough. Think of how many majorly successful open-ended games still don't offer that like at all. And I'm not saying it, it's, it's what I want to do in every game. But it matters to me that that's offered to me. And I guess with The Sims, I just feel, like, impressed that that's, like, available. You know what I mean? Um, I also just wanted to say – hold on. I'm going to go back to my little chatting screen here and get rid of my – I guess we're just watching. We're still watching this video. Let me see. Hello. Trying to figure out where this buzz and get rid of it. There we go. I have moved. Where am I? Where am I though? Oh my god. Put me in the pool where I belong. There we go. There she go. Um I just wanted to say as well, if you guys like this type of content, we did a Sims video on the YouTube channel this week that was so enjoyable. Um I had a really good time. And if you guys are into Sims content, come over to my YouTube channel. I'm thinking of doing more Sims content because I had a really, really good time creating this. Um, this week, I just want to show you. I'm not going to like make you guys watch my own channel, but I might. Hi, it's Trixie. Welcome back to the channel. Ooh. And today, let's my look at voice. our brand Jeez. new friend, Hotline at Trixie Cosmetics. Would you just stop? Do you guys ever hate the sound of your own voice? 
Okay, me neither. Hi, it's Trixie. Let's oop. And I oop. And I oop. Uh, you guys, thank you for joining me. Thank you to The Sims and Maxis. Happy birthday. Thank you all of you for joining me back on Twitch. This was really fun. I want to come back to Twitch. This made me, like, really, like, miss it. This was really enjoyable. I love playing video games on here for you guys. And uh, if you're in Los Angeles, I'm DJing tonight um, in East Hollywood, uh, Los Feliz. So if you want to come see me perform, um, I really appreciate you, all of you. Uh, gorgeous behavior. Um, I'm going to leave you guys out. I'm going to grace you guys with uh, an opportunity to watch my latest video here, I guess. Because we play The Sims in this video, and I become a doctor, and it's very cute and fun. So um, I'm going to show it to you guys, if that's cool. Is that all right, babes? Thank you guys. I'm going to show you guys me playing The Sims here, and it was really, really fun. And uh, this is me being a doctor in The Sims. It went about as well as you'd think. So enjoy.